Hey, thanks for checking this out. I'm Cor Crossan. This is Crossan C's Monday Trends, and today we're going to be covering CBD oil. Now, this is really cool uh, thing that's happening with CBD oil. I don't know if you're um, interested in it or in the market for it, but if you're watching this video, I think you are. So it's really interesting. I thought it was cool, so I made this video. That being said, remember to like, share, subscribe. Also in the description box below, click on the link, my number one way to make money online. Uh, put in your name and email, get on my email list and watch the video afterwards. It's a video that really helped me and got me pointed in the right direction and set up with a bunch of guys that really uh, would help and support me on my way to becoming an entrepreneur and start my own business online. That being said, let's go get to those trends. All right, this is Monday Trends CBD oil. This one's gonna be pretty interesting, a little different from the other ones I've done. Um, and it's gonna be quick and easy and with a few ideas on how to promote the stuff at the very end. All right, so here are the stats uh, from the online stuff I've seen. Uh, TikTok, their hashtag for CBD oil is 176.5 million and 2.2 million for CBD oils. Now, Pinterest is flooded with CBD posts, but I wasn't able to find hashtags or on trends. Uh, I wasn't able to find hashtags on trends either on purpose, like on Google, they took keywords out um or it's just they just don't have enough volume but if there's that many posts i feel like there's volume but they just don't have uh just don't have the data on it because it's a kind of a controversial issue and they want to steer clear from it now on google trends they had one keyword uh cbd oil in the category of pets and animals that's the one that's going off uh, i was not health fitness anything like that it's people want cbd oil for their pets so if you're writing a blog if you're doing that sort of thing and your one of your offers is a CBD oil, or even if you have a blog about CBD oils and CBD products, you can gear art your articles around animals because it's going off right now. And uh, Microsoft does not have a lot of traffic for CBD oils now. Microsoft Bing is a little more lenient than Google, but still there are just not a lot of traffic for. Uh, the keywords online and Instagram CBD oil is 3.3 million well CBD oils C <laughs> CBD CBD oils uh, with the S is 256,000 from those numbers you would think that CBD oil is going away or CBD pr uh, products in general that it's lost its uh, appeal but that's not the case um, it was predicted back in 2014 that it would, that by 2021 sales would reach 1.6 billion uh, what it actually hit in 2020 was 2.7 billion uh, that's a that's over a billion more than they expected and this is with a dip because of covid of 6.1 percent and it's also expected to reach 3.5 billion in uh, by the end of 2021 now what's interesting about this is its online presence isn't there anymore, man. Uh, you can't really find ads on Google for CBD oil. Uh, and Amazon uh, only has 625 results when I searched it. Well, something like Cat Toys has about 5,000. So this is the industry, and these are the oils. Now, I'm being very specific on this. This one's more broad because there's all sorts of different CBD products, gummies, edibles, stuff like that, you know? But with just the oils, can't find it. But again, the only place I've seen seen a trend, a spike, is actually in the pets. Where can you promote this? Or what would be the best way to promote this thing? Well, if you're writing a blog um, online and you really just want to gain traffic and sell certain products, sell um, CBD oils or CBD products in general for a pet and uh, gearing it around the benefits it has. I'm assuming it's with anxiety and maybe even stuff with uh, skin stuff. But other than that, it's uh, the online presence isn't really there anymore. The best I've seen was blogs mentioning certain products. You go on the blog, you click on the product, and they're getting traffic that way, which you know is not a bad deal. But because of certain barriers, because of the nature of marijuana and THC and the federal laws, it's difficult to uh, sell these things online, depending on your um, the amount of THC in your 
uh, CBD oil. So I hope that helped. Hope that was an informative video. I thought it was interesting because Google, you can't just, you can't find their keywords. Um, they have one keyword in their keyword planner, but you can't actually add it into your campaign. You can't promote on it. Uh, so it, you have to get creative. And what I found that most people, the reason why it's st uh, still selling and still going is that people are getting their CBD oils and their CBD products in person and not online. Uh, that being said, this is Core Crossing uh, and Crossing Seas Monday Trends. Remember to like, share, subscribe. Also, in the description box below, there's a link. My number one way to make money online. Click on it and uh, watch the video. Get on my email list, and I hope er, you. I hope for the best for you guys. I hope you guys have a great day and have a good one.